It so happens that Apple likes to move cameras. Sometimes they are diagonal, sometimes vertical, sometimes horizontal. This year will apparently be no exception. Renders of what the camera will look like in the iPhone 16 series smartphones have even appeared online, as well as a detailed description of how the new capture button works. Now, we will discuss everything in detail, but before we start, I recommend subscribing to our channel and clicking on the bell so as not to miss the release of new videos. Hi all, you are on the Recovery Hub channel. Give your like and let's get started. Let's go. Let's start with the design. The Mac Rumors portal published renders of the iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus smartphones based on the received drawings and the latest leaks and insights. So, according to the publication, smartphones will have a vertical arrangement of main camera sensors. Outwardly, it even somewhat resembles the design of Nothing Phone 1 or iPhone 10 released back in the Senate. However, such a design is not a whim of the company, it is a necessity. The thing is that thanks to this arrangement of sensors, the iPhone 16 and 16 Plus smartphones will be able to record spatial videos, which can then be viewed using the Apple Vision Pro Mixed Reality headset. At the moment, you can only record such videos on iPhone 15 Pro and 15 Pro Max smartphones. In addition, the iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus smartphones have an action button instead of a silent mode switch. Now this button is exclusive to the 15 Pro and 15 Pro Max smartphones. Changes have also been prepared for the Pro model. So, according to the VCF Deck portal, the iPhone 16 Pro display is expected to increase to 6.3 inches due to a larger body. This will allow you to place a periscope on the rear panel. The 16 Pro Max will also grow to an impressive 6.9 inches, a real shovel. Another common innovation for all models will be the capture button. According to the MCRS portal, it will recognize several levels of pressure, thereby simulating the shutter button in digital cameras. In addition, swipe gestures on the button will be supported. You can zoom in or decrease the zoom. A light press will focus and take a photo. If you have ever used cameras, then you give or take understand how this will work. The capture button will be located on the right side of the smartphone. Also, according to insider Jeff Poo, this year all iPhone 16 series smartphones will receive 8 GB of RAM and the younger iPhone 16 and 16 Plus models will support Wi-Fi 6E currently. This is the WI standard. FI is supported only by Pro 15th series processors. This year, I will show two Apple 18 and Apple A18 Pro. The first will be installed in the basic models, and Pro, accordingly, will receive the Apple A18 Pro chip. This year, Special emphasis will be placed on artificial intelligence, neural networks, and generative capabilities. What do you think of this design of the iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus smartphones? What are your thoughts on this? We, as always, are waiting in the comments to the video. We make sure to read all comments and happily respond to the most interesting ones. Well, the most important thing you can do is subscribe to the channel and click on the bell so you don't miss the release of new videos. You were on the Recovery Hub channel. Subscribe to the channel and like this video. See you in the next videos. E